I just hate that product. It does not work only. Base game is sorted with this palette. So beautiful. You're gonna love this blender. Try it out on my recommendation. You'll thank me later. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to yet another video. I hope you all are doing fine. And I'm finally here with a super, super helpful video for all the beginners out there. So in today's video, I'm going to share with you all the affordable products that you can invest in as a beginner. They are super good quality and all these products are under 500 rupees. Now, when it comes to good quality, affordable products under a budget and that to 500 rupees, most of the products that I picked up were again from Maybelline, but I have already made a video wherein I did a full face of makeup using Maybelline products. If you haven't watched that video, check it out here. So I didn't want to use a lot of Maybelline products in this video. So it took me a little bit of efforts, but I managed to pick out products that are not from Maybelline and yet good quality and affordable. I will mention the prices of all the products here on the screen and the links in the description box below so you can check them out. So yes, if you want to know what are products I would recommend you to buy as a beginner all under 500 rupees, then keep on watching this video till the very, very cool. This is the editing me. I was just editing today's video. That's when I received a mail from Trell. Now Trell is a video and shopping app. There are a lot of brands, makeup, skincare and a lot more on Trell. So all the products that I'm mentioning in today's video, you can check out on Trell and they already have amazing offers going on and you can use this code of mine and you can get additional 20 percent off so it is a win-win situation i have a linked it down in the description box below so you can check it out happy shopping and if you are new to my channel hi my name is sony mishra i post beauty and lifestyle content here on my channel so please take out a moment and subscribe to my channel down below and don't forget to hit the notification bell right next to it so that you get notified every time I upload a new video that is on Tuesdays and Saturdays. Now without any further blabbering, let's just dive right into this video. Okay. So I will share the products in the order of their usage. So firstly, before makeup, obviously you have to prep your skin. For that, you need a good moisturizer. Now, you know, I love the Pons moisturizer, but I don't want to uh, repeat the same product again and again but because it just gets boring. So this is the moisturizer that I would recommend. Now, this is the Cetaphil Moisturizing Lotion. This is for all skin types, face and body. This moisturizer is amazing. You'll see how the, all these products work in the next video. But I just love this moisturizer. You are going to love this moisturizer regardless of the skin type that you are. So now this is a 250 ml bottle. You get a 100 ml bottle under 500 rupees. So yeah, and that will last you a long time. So that's that. Now you have to moisturize your lips as well before makeup. For that, I have a different lip balm today. That is this Nykaa Macaron Lip Balm in the Vanian Lemon. You can see how much I have used this lip balm. It is almost about to reach the pan. And this is amazing. Like uh, this lip balm, you rub your finger and this turns into a lip oil. Like it has literally, it has an oil type consistency. It is so, so, so light. It is not at all heavy on your lip. And yet it hydrates your lips so beautifully and it stays on for a long time. I love this lip balm. Now your skin prep is done. Moving on to the makeup. For makeup, the first step has to be primer. Now for primer, the one I would recommend is not a new one. But yes, this is the Inside 3 in 1 primes, products and moisturizes long lasting oil free primer. So this is a 30 ml bottle. It is very, very affordable. You can definitely check it out if you're a beginner. It does blur your skin. It gives a very, very smooth canvas to work on. This works absolutely brilliantly. The price it comes for this is a gem. You have to use this one if you haven't already. Coming to the next product will be a foundation. So for foundation, the one I'm going to recommend you today is this Lakme 9 to 5 Primer Plus Matte Perfect Coverage Foundation. Now this foundation I have used for quite a time before recommending you. This is a very, very lightweight foundation. It does not feel very thick or heavy on your skin. It blends beautifully. It is a medium buildable coverage. Uh, you can build it up to an extent, but it gives you a medium coverage and it is beautiful to wear for an everyday basis. It, and I'm in the shade W180 Warm Natural. 
now for blending your foundation you can use a brush or a beauty blender i prefer blending my foundations and concealers using a beauty blender and this one i had to recommend it i am using this beauty blender for quite a long time now and i absolutely love this beauty blender it is so so affordable this one is from mars cosmetics you have to try this it is their wonder blender something of that sort or the names and everything is here on the screen so this is amazing you have to try your hands out on this blender for a beauty blender of this quality it is amazing you have to check this blender out okay. now moving on to the next step uh, concealer now for concealer i have two options and now both of these are my absolute favorites this is again from maybelline fit me i had to include it because this is my absolute favorite concealer now uh, maybelline does has a full coverage concealer but i prefer this one and also it fits the budget so this is the maybelline fit me concealer 30 honey shade this concealer is beautiful it is a medium buildable coverage and it conceals your spots and under eyes so beautifully it is lightweight it blends beautifully and it gives such a beautiful finish i absolutely love this concealer now the second concealer i have is this one from swiss beauty this is their liquid concealer now you must have seen this all over the internet it was a hype of a time and uh, I love this one. I have this in the shade Sand Sable. This is very, very light for my skin, but I use it to highlight my under eyes and it does a brilliant job at that. It is uh, it is said to be a full coverage concealer, but it is not a full coverage concealer. It is more so a medium coverage, but uh, it works beautifully and it is very, very affordable. So if you're a beginner, you can definitely check this out. It is very lightweight, it blends and spreads very, very easily. It is not very, very thick. So you're not going to have a hard time blending it out. So you can check this out. You have to trust me you have to after your foundation is done concealer is done you have to pack your face and for powder uh, you can use a loose powder or a compact powder i don't prefer packing my base with a compact powder i left that a long time back because i observed that when i use compact powder to set my face uh, my base looked cakey so i uh, switched to loose powder and that was the best decision ever i do touch up sometimes with the compact but not so but it is all up to your preference so if you want to go for a compact i would suggest you using this maybelline fit me compact this is the only compact that i own this comes with a mirror so that is very very um uh, handy uh, for traveling as well and it is a very very good compact it's just that i don't like compacts uh, anymore so that's that and for the loose powder i would recommend you using the mars loose powder this is the matte translucent variant and this powder is amazing this powder puff thing and this puff is also beautiful like i just throw all the puffs that come in the compacts and all but this puff is very very good i usually use this to set my under eyes and it works very very beautifully the powder is very very finely milled and it gives such a smooth uh, finish to my under eyes i absolutely love this powder and it sets the base properly it gives a beautiful finish what else you need and it is affordable as well so that's very very good now for giving the dimensions back to your face you need a contour blush and highlighter buy a palette that has all three in one so that it is handy you can travel with it and plus this particular palette is my absolute favorite so i had to include it in this video so this one is from sugar cosmetic this is the new one that i got uh, in the shade 03 fierce feet i also have it in the shade 01 subtle summit both the shades are amazing so this is the 03 fierce feet now i know this palette is not under 500 rupees costs somewhat about 700 or 800 rupees but it has three products come on so divided by three and uh, it gets way below 500 rupees so it is very very affordable and the pigmentation is beautifully i will just swatch this one for you i love this palette you have to check it out if you are a beginner your base game is sorted with this palette see the pigmentation it is amazing amazing i love this palette i have been using it since the start of my makeup journey and i love it 
Like now to set your base you need a makeup fixer or a setting spray today i have this makeup fixer from swiss beauty this is the most affordable makeup fixer and the work that it does is amazing it will lock your base so beautifully it lasts very very long and uh, amazing makeup fixer the mist is also beautiful again i have been using this for a very very long time and i absolutely love this makeup fixer just that it has a little bit of fragrance so if you don't like fragrance in your makeup so you might not like this so that's that but it is a very beautiful makeup fixer then coming to your eye makeup now for eye makeup the first is the eyebrow product because that's the order that i like to do it in so the eyebrow pencil that I rave about every time is again from Sugar Cosmetics. The Arch Rival Brow Definer in the shade Woody Scooby. This comes with a spoolie at one end. This also had a cap. I just lost it somewhere. And a pencil on the other end. It is a retractable pencil. So it is very, very convenient. And this eyebrow pencil is very, very pigmented buttery smooth it glides on like a dream you do not have to do a lot of hard work just a little bit of strokes here and there and your eyebrows are perfectly fine to go next for eyeshadow if you're a beginner i believe your face palette will work very good as your eye palette as well you can i have used this shade on my eyes today you can use this shade also and if you want that little bit of shimmer highlight you can use this on the center of your lids so that's that uh, there are a lot of uh, good uh, budget friendly eyeshadow palettes available in the market but i have not tried any out which is under 500 rupees so that's why i don't have any matte eyeshadow palette here but i do have a frosty pigment palette here and i didn't use it in the look today but i still had to recommend this because this palette is so so beautiful see the shades and these all are frosty pigments the foil eyeshadows and they are so pigmented just see very pretty very very pretty the shimmer the reflect it has is amazing and it has 10 different shades and it was so so cheap 100 something or maximum 200 rupees i don't remember the price i'll insert it in the screen but it is so beautiful so if you are into foil eyeshadows or you'll want shimmer um, eyeshadow palette this is very very amazing very amazing now moving on to eyeliner this is my absolute favorite you all know it by now this is the elf cosmetics liquid eyeliner now i have the elf cosmetics pen liner as well but i do not like it i, I just hate that product it does not work only i don't know if i got a defected product or what but it feels like it has been kept for ages and ages and it is almost on the verge of drying so i don't like using that it just makes my job difficult but i love this one from elf cosmetics this is my absolute favorite eyeliner and it is very very affordable as well uh, jet black one swipe pigment amazing coming on to the mascara this is the mascara i would suggest again from mars cosmetics again a hidden gem it, uh, just a drawback i don't like is that it has a very very thick wand see the one this is a very very thick one and every time i try applying this mascara i either get it on the eyelid you can see i have a dot here or i get it on my nose i don't know why with this mascara every time i get it either on my eyelids or my nose but this mascara is amazing this separates your lashes and gives it a beautiful curl and volume i absolutely love this mascara and very very affordable again you have to check it out now coming to the last products that are the lip products so i have four lip pro sorry i have four lip products here so firstly uh finally i have started using lip liners uh, I didn't use lip liners for a long long time I just applied my lipsticks directly but now that I started using lip liners I know I know why you should so for lip liners uh, you can check this one out from Swiss Beauty these are beautiful now I got this entire set of 12 so this entire set costed me 300 something rupees i think the mrp is somewhat 500 rupees for 12 
and you get 12 lip liners for 500 rupees like for one it is so so cheap it does not even cost you 50 rupees it is so affordable and yet it is so pigmented buttery smooth glides on perfectly so you have to check these lip liners out then for lipstick the one i have on is from maybelline creamy matte you know i love these lipsticks now some formulas i love for nude lipsticks i have made a video you can check it out in the i button so there are a lot of lipsticks that i love uh, you can check them out but this one is uh, maybelline creamy matte in the shade nude nuance that i'm wearing on my lips and this is my absolute favorite one liquid lipstick that i absolutely love is this one from lacme forever matte liquid lip color this again is very very affordable very very light and thin formula uh, like you don't you would not feel like there is something on your lips it is so comfortable very very light it's just that it's so light that you have to layer it up like two to three layers to get that opaque finish but worth it it is beautiful so you can check this liquid lipstick out and at the end i have this lip gloss from inside cosmetics this is the inside makeup essentials long wear color rich lip gloss now i haven't used uh, lip glosses in a long long time i recently started using them and this lip gloss is beautiful it does not feel very very sticky on your lips and it lasts pretty well and it looks beautiful that's all that I can say about lip glosses because I have just started using them. So I don't know how to describe uh, lip glosses but this one is good. You can try it out if you are a beginner because I am a beginner when it comes to lip glosses and I'm quite liking it lately. So you can check this out. So, so yeah with this all the products are done. I think I didn't miss any of it. Yeah I hope you like this video. I hope you found this video helpful and uh, all these products that I have mentioned I have been using these products for quite a while now and you can trust me when I say these are really really good quality products. Even though they are so affordable, they work amazing, amazingly well. So you can definitely check them out if you are a beginner. And even if not a beginner, these products are very, very good quality. You can go for it. And this is the makeup look that I created using all these affordable products. And this is the look that I posted on my Instagram and got a lot of requests for a tutorial. You love my lip shade and the eye makeup and the entire makeup in general. So I decided to film this tutorial. So the next video will be this makeup tutorial. So make sure you stick around for that as well. Now, now I'll end this video right here itself. I hope you liked today's video. And if you did, please consider hitting the like button. Please drop your views in the comment box below. Any suggestion, any views, any opinions, everything is warm heartedly welcome drop them in the comment box below and if you have not subscribed to my channel yet please do it now i am working really really hard for this channel to grow and we are about to hit a 500 like mm, a little bit far but still very very close and i think we can do it so please click on that red subscribe button down below and don't forget to hit the notification bell right next to it so that you get notified every time I upload a new video. Now I will see you super super soon in my next video. Till then stay safe, stay healthy. Bye bye.